Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, cats and dogs, and freaks of nature of all ages. My name is Brian Bad Hippie Jackson, and welcome back to Treasures of the Dead. In the last episode, we played levels five and six, six being the ver first divine challenge stage, and now we're going to be getting into episodes seven and eight, which is going to be cool. And as you can see, I've already been hit. I wasn't paying attention to what I was doing. I was goofing off and trying to adjust my bandy cam, and I did not have the game pause. <laughs> and these creatures just came up and hit me and turned around and walked the other direction. And I'm like, you little bastards. So anyways, let's go ahead and continue game. And go shoot this fucking skeleton right there. That's the one that got me. Now, as you can see over on this side, there's the divine fire chest right there. And over on this side, we have divine fire hazards. So that's kind of off limits until after we get the chest. You know. And I'm starting at a little bit of a health disadvantage because I was a bonehead and didn't watch what I was doing. But, you know, shit happens. It's not like you guys have never seen me be a bonehead before. And we're not going to checkpoint yet. We'll wait until we open that chest and we're coming back out before we checkpoint it. <laughs> ah! That's what I'd get for trying to go too fast. See that crap? health again. Ooh, woo, woo. That was close. That was close. Pay attention to what you're doing, hippie, or you're going to be a dead hippie. Okay, let's let him... So that we can stay out of the way of that blood wall. I thought one of them was going to get me. I thought one of them was just going to keep on coming. Let's go ahead and get this mummy. There's the lightning key. See, everything is this it's all about the timing. All about the timing. All you gotta do is is take take the time to take the time. That's it. Just take the time to take the time. Pause every once in a while. Just 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 get into a place where you know nothing's going to hit you and watch and just figure out what the timing is. Once you get that timing figured out, you're good to go. It's just, you know, it's all about, to, I went old school on this. Of course, it's really, you know, sprite based. There's really not a whole lot of options other than old school. I mean, there's there's a lot of other stuff you could do with a good with a sprite based game, but... I forget, I, I wasn't even paying attention. I forget if the hearts give you points or just health. I know that killing the monsters gives you points. Um, and the score is down in the bottom right. I got 48,655 right now. Um, so killing the monsters gives you 
points based, you know, depending on what kind of monster it is. The tougher the monster, the more points. And then treasure gives you points depending on what kind of treasure it is. I think the silver coins are the least, and then there's gold coins, uh, gold and silver bars, and there's um, pearls, black pearls, gemstones, um, different treasure chests. Whoa! Of course, some of the monsters move at a faster speed than others. There's two speeds of skeletons. You have some skeletons that move, you know, kind of like those little slow-moving mummies do, and then you have some skeletons that'll just haul ass right at you. Now, you can't shoot through the divine chests. Nope, the hearts don't give you points. I was paying attention that time. So if you miss a heart, it's okay. It's not going to affect your point score. Oh, oh, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Go away, go. Holy shit, that was fucking close. God damn. All right, that was a Guardian Spectre. And he popped up. Guardian Spectres start on level 8. Is the first time you'll run into one. And I think there's two or three of them on this level. Um, but they... They uh, spawn in random locations. You never know where the Guardian Spectre is going to show up. Uh, and they will actively pursue you. You saw that bad boy just coming straight down at me. I thought he had me there for a minute. But that's just one of the things you gotta, that, that makes the game interesting is when you get the Guardian Spectres, you never know when or where. Well, you do know when, starting at level uh, 8, but you don't know where. I think I'm going to save that heart back, just in case, because in here we have spirits we need to avoid. The transparent bitches can't be killed. There's the lightning. Oh, back, 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 back. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Get oh, I died. Jesus Christ. Oh, now I gotta do all that shit again. <laughs> That's all good. Shit happens. It's part of the fun of playing games is screwing up and getting dead. Because in real life, if you screw up and get dead, you don't get a freaking mulligan. In a game, you do. Okay, we're still going to do the same thing we did last time. We're going to save that heart back just in case we need it. Okay, there's the water key. Let's go down here in a safer area and pick up some coinage. There's the fire key down there. Oh! Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Don't let me get killed by two specters in a row. That would suck butthole. There we go. That's better. That's better. See, good thing we saved that heart back. Now we have the three keys that we need. So let's go back out this way. Oh, wrong way. This way. There we go, there we go, there we go. Awesome, awesome sauce. Chest. 
I don't need that heart. But I'm gonna end up grabbing it anyways. Oh no, 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 no. Holy fuck stains. Jeez, how did I survive that? Oh my god. Oh my god. That was just one piece of really bad luck getting in there and then a piece of really good luck not freaking dying. Crap. There's a Guardian Spectre right there. And he's not wanting to come, come around that corner. Come on, come on. Down, down. You little bitch. You little bitch. just was not cooperating with his own demise. Okay, back up in here now. And just don't get hit by anything. No Blood walls, no specters, no spirit. Just don't get hit. Don't get hit, hippie. You get hit, you die. And there's only a red heart down there. You need more than that. Well, that give me back a little bit of health at least. A little bit's better than none. Oh, oh man. Finish off this stuff down here. Oh! Is. Well, kind of, sort of. I mean, you have one of... Oh, man, I got fucked up good earlier. Ah! Ah! Okay, I think that's the last chest, so now I should be able to get out that final hallway. So we got lightning, water, and fire in that final hallway there. So now that I got all three chests, all three keys, all three chests, I should be able to get out of that hallway with no problem. Doom, doom. Awesome sauce. Boom. There it is. All right. Oh, there's a Guardian Spectre right there. See that little fucker? Okay. <laughs> Please do not forget to check the links in the description below for the Disabled American Veterans and the Wounded Warriors Project. Let's please help support our veterans. If you like the video, then hit the like button, subscribe, and share. Tell your friends and family to hit the like button, subscribe, and share. Please do not forget to leave a comment. They are always welcome, good, bad, or somewhere in between. Thank you very much for watching. I greatly appreciate every single one of you. You guys are awesome. Thank you for your time, your support, your encouragement, your love. You guys, you, you make it worth it. You really do. I put a lot of effort and a lot of work into this, and every bit of it is worth it when you guys tell me you like what you see, you give me good comments on my videos. It just, it makes me feel good. You guys are fantastic. Thank you so much. And until next time, this is Brian Bad Hippie Jackson saying peace, love, clean underwear, and happy gaming.